Hey guys, welcome back. So, wanted to catch up on a few things. It's been a while since I've done an epilepsy video. And, <clears throat> I guess just being sidetracked with life. But, anyways, um, a few weeks ago, I guess I was kind of having, well really last week, having auras. And just felt like just totally out of it, like having deja vu. That kind of thing. Um, went to the doctor. Had an EEG done. And uh, everything was normal. Nothing out of place. My skin went fine. They didn't see anything. So, which is good. And I'm supposed to be having an at-home EEG. Like, overnight. I think they're supposed to, like, either mail it here or I go pick it up. I gotta get with them. Figure that out. But, yeah, it was mostly, like, auras. I felt like I was trying to get, like, deja vu, but I didn't quite get there yet, you know? It just felt like it was oncoming. And so, and of course, you know, a lot of people feel like don't really take me serious when I feel off or when I don't feel right with my epilepsy. They think I'm over-exaggerating or that I'm just making shit up, etc., I think it's sad, you know, if I tell you I'm not feeling well or I tell you something's wrong, like, take me serious. Take anybody serious, no matter what their condition is. Like, nobody knows your body but you, okay? You know your body better than anybody else because you live in it, okay? I've lived in this body for almost 40 years, okay? I know how it works. I know how it doesn't work. I know every tweak, twitch, everything, so... If I say something doesn't feel right, take my word on it, okay? I'd rather go to the doctor and be checked for something that really isn't happening instead of not going and something really happened. I'd rather be cautious, let's put it that way. Because when it comes to epilepsy and other um, disabilities or disorders, you know, you should get them checked regularly. You should... If your intu intuition is telling you, hey, I need to get this looked at, do it. Don't listen to other people. You do you. Okay? So, anyways. So, I finally kind of, like, I guess, snapped out of it. Plus, it was a stressful week. Like, it was, like, during Derby, everybody was here. I was stressed to the max with just, like, a lot of things going on at once. And... That's probably what made me kind of have that feeling. And I noticed I had, like, missed some of my medication, which I probably shouldn't have done, I know. It's just when you get 50 million things going at once, your mind gets distracted. So, anyways. But yeah, just a little rundown. As far as epilepsy, how it's going. Um, you know, I just I stay on top of it the best I can. Um, and do what I can to keep it under control. And if you don't know, mine is considered juvenile myoclonic epilepsy. I have what's called frontal and generalized seizures. So what that means is it can be like in the frontal part for the most part, but it can also move everywhere else in my brain. So there you go. Hope you enjoyed this video and I'll talk to you later.